Good day folks, we're gonna look at testing the Bosch heat pump. So here we have one new one and one is a defective one and I'm gonna show you how to test this um, the uh, good and the bad. So on a good, we'll start with a new one. The good Bosch pump, the heater terminals are this second and third one and we should typically get a reading of about 19 ohms which we are 19 to 20 ohms that's for the heating element okay so on this bad one over here when we do a similar measurement we get 20 ohms as well which is a good good thing so at this point in time you know um, one would think that there's nothing wrong with these uh, this wash pump so sometimes people do a me um, mega uh, test with a multimeter going from earth to the t live terminal and they take a reading and say you know what that's okay 17 and a half meg is, it should be fine but this bad one is actually tripping the circuit breaker so here we use another device I use a, Ky a Kairatsu insulation continuity tester to test the insulation resistance now we set the instrument at 500 volts 200 mega ohms and turn the yellow knob to the lock position so typically, when we do this type of test, um, we will do our first terminal over here is the earth terminal. That's the earth. Sorry, I need to get a good connection up there. And you have any hardly any deflection on the instrument. So you do the second terminal as well, and same. So that's a good result. That's what we'd expect. Now, on a bad uh, heat pump, when you do your testing, there you go. That's telling us a defect in the heating element. So this is where the heating element's going down to, earth. So once again, between earth and any of the live terminals, you should not get any deflection and this is only possible to do it properly using an insulation continuity tester so the multimeter method if anyone tells you to use the multimeter to do insulation testing it's a device that's not used uh, designed for that purpose so this is how we do some basic testing to verify that the heating elements actually working properly on a Bosch heat pump and the particular uh, pump that we're looking at over here is double zero six five one nine five six. So here again, I have another Bosch heat pump. This is slightly smaller in dimensions, but then again, we can use the same principles to test. So let me just. So again, once again, earth terminal. So our insulation resistance is very good on this uh, pump. But this pump is still bad. So we will use our multimeter once again to test. And we will see that we have an open circuit in this circumstance so between the heater terminals we should have 20 ohms and we have open load so ol is dis uh, displayed so that's an open circuit so in this case the customer complained that there's no heating so that, that would explain it as the heating elements are burnt out thank you very much